guys on target training out here in Oregon. We did a review last week of this model 19-3 from Smith & Wesson. What I really like about this gun and what we're going to do today is put it to the test with some of the things that uh, I pointed out last week make a big difference for me. That includes the target trigger and target hammer. Now I'm going to do all the drills today in double action because for me uh, with this type of revolver, especially one that has a double action trigger as good as this, that's just the way I'm going to shoot the gun. Could I shoot it in single action? Absolutely. And the single action is fantastic. But for the purposes of today and what I'm working on, I really want to work this double action trigger. We're going to be shooting some of my reloads. The bullet heads are from BioBullets and they have that powder coating on them. This is an extremely light load. So yes, it's 357 Magnum. Yes, it's hotter than 38 Specials and even than the Plus P, but not much. So, so we're five yards from our target. I'm just gonna fire a couple of cylinders at the targets out there and see what kind of results we get. I have not adjusted these sights for this ammunition. And as you guys know, shoot 357s, um, depending on the velocity of the bullet, the bullet type and other things, especially as you get out past 10 yards, you really need to make some adjustments to the sights. That has not been done with this load yet. Ah. Okay, let's try it again. Not bad, uh, not as good as I would like, but, but not bad. So now we're gonna shoot the Model 19 at 35 yards. Five out of six, not bad. About 50. All right guys, about 15 yards down range, we have some steel. And I'm sure some of you guys are going, gosh, she's shooting super slow. Yeah, I am. <laughs> Hits count. And since I don't have any bad guys shooting back at me, in that case, hits would really count. But since I'm just trying to work my marksmanship skills, guys, that's where my focus is. It's on sights and trigger press. And to me, that is one of the huge advantages of shooting a double action revolver or any kind of double action gun, but particularly one that is double action only uh, from a semi-automatic or in this case, a revolver double action for all the shots or that's what I'm working on today. Now, no excuses here, but one of the things I find with this setup is the black front sight against a black target. I really struggle with my eyes at this age to be able to really see that. So those last two shots, I was struggling to see the targets. No excuses. I should have spent more time, been a little more deliberate. Well, folks, that's a quick look at the beautiful Model 19. What's there not to appreciate? Elegant looking gun, beautiful bluing, beautiful workmanship on the gun, fantastic double action trigger, target trigger, target hammer, and the ability to shoot both 357 and 38 specials. I appreciate all of you watching. 
all your comments and feedback. Finally, and as always, stay safe.